So this video is sponsored by Electronic Arts. So what is going on guys, my name is Zero and welcome back to another Plants vs Zombies 2 video here today on the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at not one, but two brand new plants in the game. The first plant is called the Turkey Pult, which will hurl zomboid-like turkeys into the sky, which will then attack zombies in its lane. And the second plant is called the Headbutter Lettuce, which will headbutt zombies on the left and right of the plant. That does quite a lot of damage, and it will also drop butter occasionally, similar to the butter effect that Colonel Pult has. Both of these plants can be attained with seed packets in various different game modes. Turkey Pult will be put into Arena Seasons, but Head Butter Lettuce will have a separate event, so keep your eyes out for that. You can, of course, also purchase both of these plants through the in game store, so that's another alternative if you do want to pick them up nice and quick. Let's start off though by taking a look at Turkey Pult. So like I did mention at the start of the video, the turkey pult will hurl zomboid-like turkeys into the sky, which will then land onto the lanes and start attacking the zombies. I do want to also mention that the turkey pult will deal a little bit of damage when it hits the ground right next to the zombies, sort of like an instant damage attack, and then it will continue to peck at the zombies, dealing even more damage. Once it's pecked at the zombies and destroyed them, it will continue to go down the lane, attacking the next next zombie. It's also part of the armament family, and if you use plant food, it's actually going to fire a storm of large armor turkeys all over the lawn that will be able to deal more damage and also have more health, so they're going to take out more zombies. And one thing which I have noticed while playing with the turkey pult, it's actually a great counter to gargantuas. If you have a few turkey pults in a single lane and there is a gargantua in that lane, by the time the gargantua has smashed down to destroy the turkey, there's going to be a second turkey already attacking the gargantua. So it's very difficult for the gargantua to continue moving forward. He's fully focused on trying to smash those turkeys. I think that the turkey pult is a very powerful plant, especially if you do have a few in each lane. Now let's move over to the head butter lettuce, which first of all, can we take a look at the animation? It is hilarious how he just bashes his head around smashing them and occasionally just screams randomly That's 100% screaming no pun intended the humor of the plants vs zombies design I absolutely love it, but we're not here about the animation We're here to talk about what does the head butter lettuce do? Well, it does smash its head around to the left and the right of the plant and will attack the zombies Similar to how the bonk choy works, but it does deal a lot of damage and when I mean a lot of damage I mean a lot of damage not only does it deal a lot of damage But its attack speed is very quick as well meaning that it's gonna put out even more damage and occasionally while the head butter lettuce is attacking it will slip loose some butter which will go in the lane that it's in the lane above and the lane below this of course means that the zombies that get hit by the butter cannot move and also cannot attack so the head butter lettuce will be able to deal more damage without a risk of being attacked in the lane that it's in now this butter will deal damage to the zombies when it hits them however unlike colonel pult the butter damage will actually go up as the plant level increases so the higher level your head butter lettuce is the more damage the butter will do when it hits the zombies it's also part of the enforcement family so you can use the enforcement to be able to buff up the head butter lettuce and if you use plant food on this brand new plant as well while headbutting forward and backwards which will happen much quicker it's going to cause devastating damage but also hurl butter all over the lawn, meaning that lots and lots of zombies will get hit by the butter, therefore not able to move or attack. But there we go, those are the two new plants in the game. Let me know which is your favorite in the comments down below. Honestly, I love the animation of head butter lettuce, but I think both of these plants are absolutely amazing. So make sure you go pick them up in game while you can nonetheless though thank you so much for watching today's video if you did enjoy it make sure you do drop a like down below subscribe if you are new and hopefully i'll catch you all in another video